fun Saturday brought to you by Mazda. High school football, Owensboro high down three. Oh, Nick Walker, kiss one Walker, it's tipped three times. Young That's a game. Track. Time to bring it back. Young Bang Saturday. Mm. Oh, just we the best. And we always pass the test. Gotta pass it. Thanks to the teachers and the rest. Thank you. To the teachers and the rest. We always fight for the dub. Gotta get it. We a family, so we show a lot of love. love you. Stay on <laughs> task. In class, if not, you won't pass. <laughs> 200 on the dash. Skr, skr. A lot I might crash. If you not first, then you last. Ricky Bobby. Then you last. Stay champs. We got hoopers. Nope. No bloopers, uh, and we all about skill, even on the soccer field, track, it's in our blood, all runners, they trying to be good, so natural, so no hassle, in football, we always get the tackle, Monday, sleep on the cross, they really are the ball. Welcome back Owensboro High School, here's to another episode of The View from Owensboro. My name is Mitchell Douglas. And I'm Logan Webb, and what a great top play that we had for the first time on the view from Owensboro, thanks to an amazing header from Reese Dickinson on a ball served up by Andrew Saltzman. And for the first segment today, we're going to throw it to Will and Connor and see what's drawn up in the Art Club. Let's see what they're up to. Welcome to this week's Club of the Week. I'm here with Miss Plummer talking about Art Club. Uh, tell us what uh, students can expect from the Art Club. Well, um, Art Club is designed for anybody that wants to be creative, um, likes to make art, likes to be around people that like to do the same kind of things. Um, this year in Art Club, um, starting out, I'm looking for new people because we had a lot of our juniors and seniors um, move on. So we're, we're looking for new members, so you're, anyone's welcome to join. What, what kind of things do you do in Art Club? Uh, well, behind you here. Is one of the things that we've done. We did um, some murals for Sutton Elementary. Uh, this is one of the eight uh, murals that are going to Sutton Elementary. Uh, we've done um, sort of other service projects. We've worked with the Western Kentucky Botanical Garden, done some things for them. Uh, currently, we got a mural project going on in the help desk. Um, so we like to do things like around the school in the community to kind of, you know, benefit them. Great. That sounds great. When uh, would you all be meeting? Uh, we will meet on Thursdays from 3.30 to 4.30 in room 179. Okay, guys, you heard it here first. Art Club, be there. This week, we have another appreciation segment for a special faculty member of the week. This week, it's going to be Miss Karen Brooks for the front office. Many of you know her, and she does a lot of things for around the building. So let's see what she had to say to some lightning round questions from Mitchell and Will. All right, Miss Brooks is in here. Let's go get her. You are the winner of this week's appreciation segment. Oh my gosh, well thank you. In order to win this trophy, you got to answer 10 questions in 40 seconds. You get four seconds a question. Are you ready? I suppose, yes. All right, and we're going to start in three, two, one. All right, what is your favorite holiday? Christmas. What's my name? Austin. Okay. <laughs> cake or pie? First salute, er, cake or pie? Uh, pie. Who's your first celebrity crush? Um, don't know. Favorite musician? Running out of time. I don't know. Come on Jesus. now. Jesus, okay, I don't know. Do you believe in love at first sight? Yes. How many cups of coffee do you drink a day? Uh, four. What's your favorite type of muffin? Blueberry. Name a word that starts with Q. Quick. All right, now you need to show us your favorite dance move. Gee, um. Go on, five Sorry. seconds left. Five seconds. I don't have Oh, you gotta have something. Yeah. Hey! Oh, wow. All right. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> You're the winner of this week's trophy. Woohoo! Thank you. Hey, Owens, bro. Welcome back to another great week of sports. We got a lot to look forward to, don't we, Logan? We sure do, Connor. Starting things off this week on Tuesday, the girls and guys Devils will have big games. The guys will be playing Madisonville North Hopkins High School at Shively, and the girls will be away versus the in-city rivals of Davis County. Next, we fast forward to Thursday. The guys are back in action versus Apollo at Apollo this time. This is a big, much needed district win, so be sure to show up. This Thursday, we also have a big game for volleyball. They play Frederick Frays, and it's gonna be a huge game. 
Also following that, Friday night, we play Bowling Green here at Rash Stadium. Uh, the student section theme for this game is going to be the red, the white, and the blue. Make sure you show up and show out for your Owensboro Devils, and this is a big game. So, All right, this week we're introducing a brand new segment called the Devil of the Week. Today we're here with our first uh, our first winner. Here we go. Uh, my name is Brandon Williams. I play baseball uh, here at OHS, and I'm a senior. All right, thank you, Brandon. Uh, so when you think of Owensboro High School, uh, like, what's the first thing you think of like in a sentence or two? I think about diversity, how everybody gets along at the school. And nobody really has any problems with everybody. Anybody, everybody pretty like. Everybody gets along pretty well. All right, I appreciate that, Brennan. All right, thank you. And that's to another great week of news, Owensboro High School. Thanks for tuning in. And this week, Owensboro, let's beat the Purples.